I'm David Burdett. I teach uh, air conditioning, heating, and refrigeration here at Southern Union. It is estimated that in the next three years, there will be a shortage of around 40,000 heating and air technicians across the nation. It is often that I receive calls from companies looking for technicians, looking for help. One thing about an air conditioning and refrigeration technician is that they're never stuck doing the same task over and over. It's, it's rarely repetitious. The entry-level pay for an air conditioning refrigeration technician can vary, uh, but it's certainly not unheard of for students to make anywhere from $15 to $18 uh, straight in their entry-level job. The highest income examples that I have witnessed from students leaving the program come from self-employment. A student who had started their own company and showed me their tax return where they had actually paid taxes on $140,000 worth of income three years out of my program. Once you've received those degrees at Southern Union, you are eligible to take the state board test that opens the avenue for you to own your own business. Once you receive a degree in heating and air conditioning, you certainly aren't bound to one area of the country or one area of the world. There's nowhere on earth that you go that there won't be some form of refrigeration taking place. 